Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm actually going to be doing a sort of tester trying of the new Makeup Revolution Reloaded palette. Now I have already done one of these and it was with the Neutrals 2 palette. If you haven't already seen that I will leave it here or here, whatever side it goes on. I'm going to go ahead and I am going to be doing a mini sort of review of this iconic Fever palette. Now in these videos I am not going to do any swatches because I have already got a swatch video up. Again, I'll leave it either linked on the screen or I'll put it in the description bar for you. Now, there is a lot of rumours going about that this is a, what you call it, Urban Decay Naked Heat dupe. This just looks absolutely stunning. These, like, burnt sort of deep brown red tones are just absolutely beautiful. Really, really loving this orange as well. So today I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to create a look. Again, I will show you the colours that I am using, but I'm not going to be doing like a makeup talk through tutorial where I'm like telling you guys all about the actual look because I'm just going to go ahead and create a look and just sort of play with the palette a little bit just so that I can tell you guys my honest opinions on it at the end. So if you guys want to see what look I create with this palette, then just keep on watching. So this is the finished look. I have just created this sort of coppery, burnt orange, sort of smoky eye. Um, I don't have any lashes on so it probably does look a little bit weird. A little bit of mascara on and I'm actually digging the look of this. I've done it so that the outer, like my outer V here, isn't exactly neat and tidy. It's quite smoked out, it's quite smudged, it's quite grungy. I'm loving the colours in this, it's very, very autumnal. Very grungy, smoky brown. Like you could create loads of different looks with this palette. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, really, really liking this orange. It's very, very vibrant. Just, just like the other palette, there was a little bit of kick up in like the pans. Um, like when you kind of put your finger across it, it's very, very, very pigmented. But there is a little bit of like, um, 
eyeshadows kind of fallen off because they are really really smooth and they are really really soft it is leaving them like sort of crumbling a little bit in the pan other than that it is absolutely beautiful i'm just gonna go ahead and sort of sort this bottom bit because it's really really annoying me this palette is absolutely incredible the colors are so 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 vibrant they're really really easy to blend as well even the dark sort of matte shades the shimmers are really 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 pigmented um if you want to get a little bit extra pigment with it you can also wet your brush or whatever you use um i kind of did do it with my brush and then i went in with my finger just because it was a little bit easier um just ignore this here because it's an absolute riot for four pound this is definitely worth the money it is absolutely fantastic iconic favorite is definitely getting a five out of five from me um yep absolutely love it great palette and i highly recommend you can pick it up at tan beauty or at, in super drugs um just like check online and stuff or maybe ask about if you don't see them because sometimes in a lot of super drugs they do actually have the stock in the back but they just don't tell you that if you enjoyed it please give it a big thumbs up subscribe all that usual jazz and i shall see you guys in my next video bye